Oh yeah, you know why I'm here. Oh, you know why the fuck I'm here. Hold on one second. Yeah, I don't know why the fuck I'm. Hold on, let me let me sit down some damn way. I ain't got no damn tripod, so I'm gonna put the, the phone on the back of the tissue box and just kind of prop it like that for y'all. How's that? Hold on. Got the whole wall in the shot, that'll work out. I'm gonna cool with that. Then hold on, let me make this motherfucker up before I start talking to y'all. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. So anyway, bitch, so y'all know what happened in Atlanta last night, right? Y'all know what happened in Atlanta. So new cup, new stranger, bitch. So last night in Atlanta, some simple motherfucker decided that what he going to do is rush the stage and jump on stage with Beyonce. In Jay Z, I keep forgetting that Beyonce Jay Z is also in the show. Okay, just remember that it's Beyonce and Jay Z's concert. It's not the Beyonce concert. So anyway, last night at the Beyonce concert, this motherfucker going rush the stage and run back there toward Beyonce. Now it's a good thing I didn't make this video when I was thinking about making the video last night. I took a nap and I had some time to rest on it. Because had I made this shit last night, bitch, if y'all have heard the shit I was saying last night, bitch, I was calling for, I was like, we need to, as the beehive, this motherfucker needs to be dead. We need to kill this motherfucker because we need to make an example that when you rush the queen or you come for the queen or you put your fucking hands on the queen, bitch, it's it. We kill you and your family. Now, that's what I was going to say last night. Now, I realize that, you know, maybe I shouldn't use my platform and promote violence and promote that we go out and kill this motherfucker. Then they told me it was white. And then I thought, but anyhow, girl, let me get on to the next topic. Um, I was mad as fuck last night, bitch. When I tell you I was blaming Atlanta, period. Period. It wasn't it wasn't just his fault. It was why the fuck Beyonce go to this fucking raggedy ass goddamn fake ass fucking city. They got three buildings in the motherfucker. I hear niggas in fucking Atlanta talking about something. Y'all going to the city? Bitch, what? <laughs> Ain't no goddamn city, motherfucker. That's a city, bitch. We got the city in this motherfucker. That shit y'all going to is the downtown area, bitch. That ain't no motherfucking city. So I was pissed at all of Atlanta last night, bitch. It was Atlanta's fault. But then I took a nap, bitch. I woke up today and I realized you can't blame the whole area for what one person did. But I will say this. That shit wouldn't have worked at New York's concert. At the New York Beyonce concert, Beyonce and Jay-Z. At the New York Beyonce concert. That shit wouldn't have worked. Number one, we had certain guests. So I'm just gonna tell you how this shit would've went down. Number one, I was there. Now before we get to me being there, I'm gonna tell you about what else was, who else was there. We had certain guests. So I don't know who the fuck the guest people were at in the, at the Atlanta show. I don't know who the fuck y'all had. I know, I think Memphis, not Memphis, I think Tennessee had like Jill Scott or some shit. But in New York, bitch, we had Remy Ma. Understand me. Understand me, bitch. We had Remy goddamn Ma, and we had some security, bitch, at the MetLife Center. Shout out to the MetLife motherfucking center for um making sure Beyonce and Jay-Z got home safe. Thank y'all for that shit. Because when I came up to that motherfucker, let me say I went to the concert, bitch. First of all, 
I didn't have them motherfucking um, $1,200 seats down here in the front, bitch. My tickets cost me $54. I had the $54 seats, bitch. So you know where I was. Bitch, I watched the concert from here, bitch. Bitch, I watched it from right about here, bitch. That's where I was. So I had them cheap ass motherfucking seats. So you know I was coming with my pockets tight, bitch. So that I didn't have money to splurge. So before I left the, the house, <clears throat> I was like, bitch, first of all, I can't afford a drink. I can't afford to buy nothing inside that motherfucking stadium. So what I'm going to do is pack a lunch. And I proceeded to pack me a turkey and fucking cheese before I went to the Beyonce concert, Beyonce and Jay-Z. Before I went to the Beyonce concert, bitch. I packed me a turkey and cheese and I put the motherfucking in some foil, bitch. Okay, I put it in foil. And I put myself a little goddamn juice box. You understand me? A little high C juice box along with my damn packed uh, turkey sandwich. And I put it in my book bag. And my broke ass was heading to the Beyonce concert with my $54 seats, bitch. I was heading to the goddamn concert, bitch. I'm going to the fucking Beyonce concert, bitch. Yes, ma'am. Turkey spam, bitch. So, any whore, I get to the concert, bitch, and I'm coming through the metal detectors. Now, bitch, when I tell you MetLife had security, bitch, oh, security was working that day. So, security stopped my motherfucking ass at the door. Excuse me, sir. Um, you gonna have to take the book bag off. Oh, no problem. No problem. Put the book bag to the side. I walk through the shit. And weep, 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 weep. So I stand back. Uh, do you have anything else in your pockets? No, I don't have nothing else in my pockets. Um, Y'all want to check me? Because I got to go inside to see Beyonce. So what are we going to do? Um, what, what, what is it that I don't need to have? Because all they had to tell me was like, bitch, you need to go in there butt naked. And bitch, I'd have been like, well, I guess I got to go butt naked to the Beyonce concert, bitch. I'd have been in that motherfucker ass and dick. You understand me? I'm going to see Beyonce. So... They then take my book bag and they swing that shit through like this. And that shit go beep, 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 beep. They're like, sir, what do you have in the bag? I was like, oh, I got a turkey sandwich that's wrapped in foil. So I think the foil is making it go off. So I can take the foil off because I don't have money to buy nothing to eat in that bitch, okay? So I can take the foil off. So they was like, sir, you cannot bring that turkey sandwich in there. I was like, you got about... 30 seconds for me to eat this motherfucking sandwich before I go in there, bitch. And right there, bitch, I stood off to the side. Right here, bitch. Off to the side where other motherfuckers was going because I wasn't losing my place. I wasn't losing my place. I stood right here, bitch, to the side. And I sat and ate my fucking turkey sandwich with my juice box. And... Yes, girl, we gonna see Beyonce, right? Okay, all right, I'll see y'all inside. Okay. A little dry, trying to get it down fast, you know, since you would let me bring it inside, it's a little dry. So I ate my fucking sandwich. So then after I ate my sandwich, I started to go inside, bitch. So he was like, um, sir. I'm like, damn, now yeah, what, bitch? I don't ate the goddamn sandwich, bitch. I just scarfed down a whole turkey, turkey and cheese and fucked up a juice box. Why are you bothering me? Let me go inside. He said, you can't bring that book bag inside. Do you have a car you can put it in? I'm like, nigga. This is the New York concert. Don't none of us have cars, bitch. We all came here on the subway together. Packed like sardines, bitch. Because that subway, bitch, going to the concert, everybody was going to that shit. So we using that motherfucker like this. Sweaty, funky, and steak. So, bitch, I'm like, I don't have no car to go put my book bag in. Look, I just want to go inside. He said, well, you can't bring that book bag in. I said, well, then I guess I can't have a fucking book bag. Bitch, when I tell you I took that motherfucking book bag and laid that shit right over here. And said, fuck it. Went inside. Because Beyonce said, I can't have a book bag. And who? I'm going to argue with her. I left that shit to the side, bitch. You know, y'all better see something, say something. Ain't shit inside of it. Left that motherfucker right there, bitch. And went the fucking side. Now, anyhow, I was saying all that to say this, bitch. They had security. I'm up a fucking stranger, bitch. He gonna run up on that goddamn stage. But anyhow, bitch. Now. I was in my $54 seats. The guest stars were... Remy Ma, I think Ja Rule came out, and I'm going to be confusing this shit with the, with the Formation Tour because the same motherfuckers was there for the Formation Tour. Um, DJ Khaled's annoying ass. I'm sorry. I don't have the fucking patience or the time or the ear for DJ Khaled. I don't. 
I don't know what, how everybody else feels about this little chubby motherfucker, but I'm good on just not having them. I don't need a nigga to scream over the track. That's not music to me. You sit there like, yeah, not the one. Yeah. Guess who I'm bringing out now, motherfuckers? Shit. Another one. Like, I don't need that. You can just shut the fuck up. How about that? But anyway, now had you fucking stormed the stage in New York, bitch, we had Remy Ma there. You understand what I'm saying? We had Remy Ma with the shit on the hip, bitch. You done came up on that motherfucking stage and that bitch would have wasted your... Cat, cat, cat. Don't worry, Beyonce. She all right. You know what I'm saying? She all right. You know, wherever Julia's fucking failed, the Remy Ma's ass, that bitch would have came from right here, bitch. Right from the corner, bitch. You know what I'm saying? She would... That nigga would have got up on stage and never seen her coming. That bitch would have came from right motherfucking here, bitch. Hold on. She had the wrong guest at her motherfucking show. Then on top of that, bitch. So I don't know who this little mother... Did y'all watch the video where the nigga got up on stage? Just easily got up on stage? Because my dumb ass, my black ass... This is the difference between black and white. When it comes to that white privilege. My black ass couldn't even get in the goddamn show with my turkey sandwich. This little white motherfucker don't jump on the goddamn stage... And is chasing after Jay-Z and Beyonce. Now, my black ass, I can't even get my goddamn turkey sandwich past the goddamn metal detectors. And this motherfucker on stage. And they want to tell me ain't no white privilege. That's proof right there. And then the dancers. Thank God for the female dancers, yo. Thank God for the female dancers. I don't know if that the white boy ran past one of the twins, but it was one motherfucker that was standing there, and his white ass gets up on stage, walks right past him, and this motherfucker, the dancer, the male dancer, I think it was one of the twins, this motherfucker does this shit here. If I could have swung on that motherfucker... Here come a stranger, jumps on the goddamn stage, and you gonna allow him to walk past you, and you do this shit. Anybody else coming this way? Oh, he's going after Jane B. Look at that. This motherfucker gonna turn to the side like this is the first show. Like we started doing shows today. Like, you don't know the fucking 17 motherfuckers who are normally on the stage every goddamn night when y'all do a fucking show. So you got an unrecognizable bitch up on the fucking stage, and you gonna act like it's part of the motherfuckers you familiar with. Oh, no, this unrecognizable ass motherfucking bitch over here, somebody you don't know, bitch. That is a stranger. You know what I'm saying? Stranger danger, bitch. We learned that day one. Stranger danger, bitch, and we learned to scream, ah, hell, bitch, all that's in the same breath. This motherfucker gonna turn to the side. Beyonce asked me to be a dancer, bitch. This asked me to be a dancer slash security, bitch. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna learn all them goddamn steps. That shit ain't gonna happen. But I'm gonna damn sure make sure the niggas like that don't get to you. See, if Beyonce hires me as the dancer slash security, understand that I'm going to do more security than I do dancing. So the, the dance steps is going to be kind of raggedy. I'm going to be off to the side. So you're going to have the motherfuckers that's hitting the steps. You know what I'm saying? They're going to be hitting them shit. Pow! Pow! And then you're going to have my ass kind of just, fuck, I know it's something like this. And then we, oh, are they using the other hand? God damn it. I'm going the wrong fucking direction. Okay, nope. Nope. Oh, we're here. All right. Ha! Oh, I know that motherfucker, bitch. Uh-huh. And the whole time, my bitch gonna be on lookout. What the fuck? Who the fuck is coming up on this goddamn stage, bitch? Because most of the time, it's, it's gonna look like this, bitch. When I don't know the steps, I'm just gonna hit y'all with this. This is my wish a nigga would try. Come on, motherfucker. Come on this stage tonight. Understand me. I got some pent-up shit in me, bitch. Come on stage tonight. And then the motherfucker was white? Oh, come on stage, bitch. Come on, the motherfucker, while I'm up here, bitch. Come on, bitch. I'm going to be doing a goddamn electric slide in that motherfucker. Come on stage. 
Bring your ass up here, bitch. I done watched three weeks of the goddamn Trayvon Martin story. I've been waiting for a white motherfucker to fuck up with me. Bring your ass on this motherfucker, bitch. Yeah! Oh, you thought you thought you was going. This where was where the fuck you thought you was going, bitch? Huh? Not to gay, bitch. Not to gay, bitch. So anyhow. Cause they're not gonna let me on stage. So let me just give you the reality of the reality. What would have really happened? New cup, new stranger, bitch. New cup, new stranger. You gotta be careful of these unfamiliar motherfuckers, yo. If a motherfucker's unfamiliar, don't fuck with him. Unfamiliar ass bitch. And I want his name. Or oh, they said it's two of them. I want their names. Because that's it. Fuck them. They get fucked up every time we see them. That's how that goes. And then once again to the beehive. I've been in this motherfucker a long time. You understand me? I've been in the beehive since before. It was trendy and popular. Because now we got a whole bunch of motherfuckers in here. That's letting people get to the queen. So we need some vetting. We need to vet the motherfuckers. Like fuck that shit. Everybody can't be in the hive no more. Get the fuck out. I need to vet. I need to see when you come in. First of all, hello, how you doing? Hi, yeah, I run, the, I run the gates of the beehive. How you doing? My name's Brian. Thank you very much. I've been here for a very long time. Look me up. Google me, bitch. You'll find me. Gaha, gaha, gaha. So, um, why you want to be in the beehive? Gaha, because you like her music. Get the fuck out of here. You like her goddamn music. You supposed to like her fucking music. Simple, bitch. That's the wrong answer. Go somewhere and motherfucking, go somewhere and level the fuck up, bitch, because you can't be in this motherfucker. You ain't getting in the goddamn high, bitch. Take your ass over there, put some goddamn makeup on with that other bitch. That Rihanna bitch. Go get some makeup or some shit or level the fuck up because you ain't coming in the motherfucking high, bitch. You ain't coming in this motherfucker. Not today. Come on in, huh? Why do you want to be in high? Nah. Uh -huh. Oh, because you would kill a motherfucker if somebody ever was to touch Beyonce. You would kill a motherfucker. Well, come on in. Come on in. That's the kind of motherfuckers we need in the hive, goddammit. That motherfucker said he'll kill somebody. Give me a high five. I like your motherfucker. Get your ass in the goddamn hive. Come on, who next? Come on up. Oh, look at you. You know the whole, you know all the choreography, don't you? You know all of it. Yes. Get your dumb ass the fuck up out of here. We don't need a motherfucker that's dancing when critical shit is fucking happening. I need a bitch that's swinging, not a bitch that knows an eight count. Get your ass the fuck up out of here, bitch. And I bet you know a Rihanna eight count too. See, that's the shit that I be talking about, girl. We letting all these motherfuckers inside the beehive. I'm not. I'm not. I'm the veteran. I vex these motherfuckers. Gah. Uh Gah. -huh. Uh -huh. Anyhow. The other difference had she from New York in Atlanta. I was at the New York concert. That's the motherfucking difference. And y'all saw that Beyonce went home safe, sound, and peacefully. Y'all, y'all saw it happen, right? Oh, bitch, cause let 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 me have been at that motherfucking concert, and I seen that little motherfucker jump on stage. Now, granted, he'd have got on stage if I was there because. From the $54 seats It's going to take me some time to get to this nigga But I'm going to get to him Before he gets to Beyonce Don't don't sleep on me He's going to get on stage That's gonna We're going to accept that He's getting on stage Because I'm in the $54 seat Bitch I'm back here My seats is back here So he's going to get on stage But understand me bitch When I see him from back here Oh fuck that sh I'm on my way to the stage, bitch. I'm on my way to the stage. It goes just like this. Is this motherfucker trying to storm the stage? Oh, hell no. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me. Thank you. Excuse, excuse me. Okay, excuse me. Thank you. Thank, watch your drink. Watch your drink. Thanks. Okay. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me. Just trying to... Because the motherfucker's on stage. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me. And bitch, once I get out that shit and get into the aisle, bitch... I'm coming down that motherfucking aisle and I'm gonna jump off the motherfucking balcony, bitch. And I'm gonna come to that bitch like Fortnite. You understand me, bitch? I'm. I'm. 
And I'm coming to the stage, bitch. You understand me? I'm coming to that motherfucker like Fortnite. And when I land, bitch, bow! Dropping his ass. Dropping his ass. With no weapons, no axe, nothing. Dropping the fuck out of his ass. Bitch, I wish the fuck you would. You gonna see a straight up nigga from Jersey coming from the top motherfucking rope. Just... With the elbow, just uh, bow, just drop the whole goddamn nub on the motherfucker. Just the bow, drop the nub on his ass. You know what I'm saying, bitch? Shout out to Martin. I'm just saying, I was the wrong motherfucker to do that shit in front of. I'd have beat that motherfucker for the old and the new. Y'all don't even know what type of ass whooping that is. Me beating somebody for the old and the motherfucking new. I'm beating you with pent up shit. I still got the 2016 election in me that I haven't let the fuck out on to some. I like I had that shit in me. So if I decided that I wanted to let that shit out on somebody, God help you. And you fucking with me? Oh man, look, listen here. The shit that pisses me off is this woman got three kids backstage. Waiting for her to get off stage to be mommy, to be their mother. And your stupid ass can't separate Beyonce from the person. And you feel, because I don't know what you thought would have happened. I don't know what you thought was going to was going to happen. Like they was gonna be like, oh hello, how are you? Good, nice to meet you. You're so you're just up on stage now, huh? <laughs> and I know my nigga Jay, bitch. I know Jay Brooklyn ass got a couple licks in. I know Jay got a couple licks in. That nigga's from Marcy Projects. Bitch, last night, last night they sent the police over to Marcy Projects for a crowd of motherfucking niggas that just accumulated out of nowhere. I don't know what the fuck was going on down there. I wasn't a part of it. I'm from New Jersey. I'm unfamiliar, bitch. So I didn't, I don't go to the Marcy Erica. But shout out to the female dancers, though. The male dancers, it took y'all a little minute for it to click. But my sisters, bitch, they was like, uh-uh, bitch, no, she not. No, he about to not, bitch. No, he about to not, girl. He's about to not. That's what the fuck I know. I know he's about to not. You get ready to get up on that goddamn table? I know you about to not, bitch. You about to not. Oh, you going out with your niggas tonight? Oh, you and your niggas going out? And where y'all going? Oh, y'all just going out? Y'all just going over to, to, to Ray's house to play PlayStation? You about to not, nigga. You about to not go nowhere, bitch. You about to not. Bitch, her dancers was not on it, bitch. They was about to not, girl. They was about to not have it. They was like, uh-uh, this nigga's on. Oh, he's about to not. Them hoes stomp the fuck out of his ass. Them hoes stomped his ass, bitch. Choreography. Dancer legs stomped his ass, bitch. What kind of shit is that? What kind of stomp is that? From a dancer that'll do an eight count on your ass? Why they foot in your ass a whole eight count? Bitch. That bitch went back there and just hit that motherfucker. It's like, I know the fuck you. Mm, 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 mm. Bitch, stomped in his ass, bitch. Shout out to the female dancers. The, the male dancers, they they did they didn't click on. They didn't click on, bitch. And now shout out to Julius, because God bless him, he don't kept Beyonce safe for umpteen years, bitch. Yes, he has. Big tall doofy ass motherfucker has kept Beyonce fucking safe for a very goddamn long time. But it's time to take his Neanderthal ass and put him back in his goddamn cave. Because he's done his work, girl. He has he has shown that he's done his he's done his work, and now he's showing that motherfucker. I'm getting I'm getting up there in age, bitch. My eyes ain't as good as they used to be. My reflexes ain't as good as they used to be. Cause that long armed motherfucker could have snatched him from the goddamn audience. Cause Julius ain't no little motherfucker. Julius is on some, this motherfucker, bitch. This motherfucker just. This motherfucker for fun on the weekends just polished the needle on the Empire State Building. This motherfucker, it's my day off, so I figure I'd just come here and just clean the goddamn needle on the Empire State Building because people can see the dust that's accumulating up here, bitch. 
Big tall motherfucker is what I'm trying to say. He could have snatched that boy from the audience. Just the big, as he running on stage, just from the audience, big long ass arm just and just bring him back. But see, he getting old. You couldn't see him like he used to. Motherfucker got big ass hands. Motherfucker's hands, he could he could wipe his ass and scratch the back of his head at the same time, bitch. He got big hands is what I'm trying to tell you. Shout out to Damon Wayans. Um, bitch. Do you what? Do you what? Shout out to Shauna Brooks, too. But that's what I'm saying, y'all. I basically need his name or their names. Y'all put that shit in my department. When y'all find out, and we gonna handle it from there. Oh, there will be there will be repercussions and consequences, bitch. Mm-hmm. Put that shit in my court. I wish this goddamn coffee mug was sharp. I sta I stabbed that motherfucker to death right now with this shit. Slam this motherfucker right on the edge of that shit. Right there on the edge of that goddamn windowsill. Break this coffee mug and just shank the shit out of him. On some, on some prison shit. All right, y'all, I'm about to go. Oh, God damn. Bitch, you ever see your bank slip? You know how some people... I'm getting off topic and I apologize for this. They gotta have his name by now. Um, you know how some people will, will, will go to the ATM and leave their bank statement there? Like, look at that shit, y'all. Hold that. <laughs> Woo! Money in the bank, bitch. And then you come by and you look at their bank statement and he be like, $79,000? Damn, he got $79,000 in his account. I wonder if he needs his dick sucked. Hold on, let me say, hey, sorry, do you need your dick sucked? Okay, excuse me. <laughs> bitch. I'd be too embarrassed to leave my shit behind, girl. My shit got $7.52 inside the account, bitch. So I'm not just gonna leave this motherfucker out on the counter so when somebody come by and I, and I walk away, they be like, damn, that nigga has $7.52 in his account. <laughs> Seven dollar have an ass. Bitch, I take my shit with me, bitch. That shit come out and I be looking back like, mm -mm, I'm not about to see what's going on in here. Shit. Bitch, cause most of the time I go to that motherfucker, I try to take out 20 and shit. I be having my ATM box. Boom, 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 mm, 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 I need 20. Mm, do, 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 boop, 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 boop. Declined. You don't, I don't have $20 in the account. <sighs> Ain't twenty dollars in the motherfucking account. Well, how much is in this motherfucker? That's when the that's when the dancing stopped. That's when you now you're serious. Well, how much is in this motherfucker? Oh my god, I got fucking sixteen dollars. How the fuck I'm gonna get sixteen dollars out this bitch? Shout out to now, girl, because in the backpack gaze, girl, they didn't have no motherfucking um, ATMs that was spitting out tens and fives. Now, bitch, you punching sixteen. That motherfucker will give you sixteen of your dollars, bitch. Thank you very much, ATM. That's all I need to survive for the next two weeks. I'm good. I'm good on any Malcolm X Boulevard. I'm good. I'm good. Word to blue, bitch. I'm going to be all right with $16. I've had less. I've had less. All right, let me go, y'all, because I'm just rambling. I ain't talking about shit at this point. Y'all find out that motherfucking name, though. Coffee cold in the motherfucker. Coffee is ice cold. Bitch, I'm up here sipping coffee uh, with a Starbucks hat on. How you doing, bitch? How many jobs you got, bitch? I got plenty. You know, I got as many jobs as, as Ariel got thingamabobs. You understand what I'm telling you, bitch? You want a thingamabob? I've got 20. You want a job, bitch? I've got 20. But who cares? No big deal. I need more. And that's more motherfucking money, bitch. YouTube, oh my God, there's a fucking hair in my damn shit. Gotta be mine. Gotta be mine. Ain't nobody else in this motherfucking Starbucks but me, bitch. Ain't the first hair I had in my mouth. I don't eat some hairy asses in the backpack games, girl. <clears throat> Anyhow, come back to YouTube and get this money. Bitch, don't be talking to me like that. Shit, I feel like a hoe. 
You better. <laughs> like, I'm picturing you saying that shit with your legs open, holding some money, like, right here, like, you better come back to YouTube and get this motherfucking money. I, you better come back, motherfucker. I see you like that shit. You want that money? Come back here and get this money, motherfucker. Uh-huh. Bitch, you won't be talking to me like that. Uh, excuse me, for, I have a beard now, bitch. I'm trying to give trade. You're not going to treat me a certain way, bitch, okay? I'm trying to give trade, bitch. I don't want got me some motherfucking guns while I was gone, bitch. You understand what I'm saying? I got the same shirt. That's fine. That's fine. I've had it for some years now. They gave it to me free when I used to work at AT&T, girl. And then they fired me for terroristic threats. Fuck them anyway, girl. Fuck them. It's... Yeah, I guess it would be a terroristic threat. Yeah, he was right. I wasn't going to carry it out, girl. I don't even know how to make a bomb. I was just saying, I'm going to blow this motherfucker up, bitch. I wasn't really going to blow the motherfucker up. God, I didn't even know how to make a bomb. I was going to drop his ass, though, in the parking lot. But I wasn't going to blow it up. That part was true. I do know how to drop a bitch. I don't know how to make a bomb. But I don't know. I do have the bomb-making beard now. Are we being racist? Is this, have I gone to a racist level? Just let me know if I went too far. Because, you know, motherfuckers can't take jokes now with gays, bitch. People don't know when you're joking. So, anyhow, let me just say this shit before I go. This is going to be the last shit I said, because then I'm, I'm fucking out of this motherfucker. I got to get to New Jersey. My cousin is having a book bag drive for all the kids in the community. For Roselle, he's having a book bag drive, which is like, you know, he giving back to the community. So shout out to him. Shout out to my cousin, Alex. But anywho, what the fuck was I saying? Damn, me and my fucking memory. People can't take a joke. Um... So I'm not really a fan of Wildin' Out. I don't really watch it because there's some people on Wildin' Out who are comedian funny. And I respect comedians, motherfuckers who are naturally funny and witty. I respect the fuck out of it. I love Nick Cannon to death, love everything about him. He doesn't have that. I don't give a fuck. He's not a funny person to me. He's not a stand-up person. He's not clever, quick, and fast. None of that shit. Sorry, Nick. Love you to death. And I probably will, you'll probably never see my ass on Wild and Out. Y'all just see me after the show just coming by, just sweeping and mopping the goddamn stage. This nigga won't let me on the show all because I said one thing about that he wasn't funny. Now he don't want to let me on the goddamn show. That's some bullshit. Oh, you gonna bring me on the show? I get all excited. I tell all my friends, and then you telling me you hired me for the janitor position? That's some bullshit, Nick. Fuck you. And them little fucking Nick's kids you got. Fuck all them little fucking uh, mutt looking ass motherfuckers. Fuck them kids. Mm -hmm. But anyhow, bitch. Um, but I do. I respect real comedians, and they do have some on that show who are hilarious. Like the the dude that was roasting um. Azalea Banks, that motherfucker is funny. Quick, fast, clever. Now hold him to the side. I just gotta say this shit. This don't have shit to do with Wild Out, even though she was on Wild Out. Jess is hilarious. That bitch is funny. She funny as a motherfucker, yo. I don't give a fuck with no. That bitch be having me like gut laugh. I love that bitch. But anyhow, back to the fucking show. So I don't really watch the show like that. But I understand what the what the show is. We come on stage, we tell jokes, we'll roast you, yada yada yada, throw some shade, go home, we're good. So the show didn't start yesterday. This show been on for a very long time. So I don't understand Azalea Banks, who went on the show, who ended up in her feelings. And then tried to flip it. Because you know what, what kills me with motherfuckers like this bitch here? Azalea Banks, and then bitches like Amarosa, y'all be like, fuck the black community, fuck y'all niggas, kiss my ass, suck my dick, fuck y'all niggas, and then something happened, and the first thing y'all doing is reaching for black people, like, no, no, wait a minute, um, listen, listen, he's coming for my complexion, he's coming for my complexion, the first thing y'all start doing is reaching for niggas, when the motherfucking white people toss your dark ass to the motherfucking side, y'all start reaching for. He's talking about my complexion. He's saying that I'm ugly because I'm dark skinned. No, bitch, that wasn't it. 
Motherfuckers can't take jokes. This bitch went for, for Nick Cannon's disease and everything. Bitch, what the fuck is wrong with you? That bitch. And then this, oh girl, and this, this motherfucking retarded lady bitch. I don't understand. This is me. I'm 37 now since I started this shit. 37. So I have less of an understanding for motherfuckers like Takashi 69. That shit, and I realize it's my age and the quality of music that I like. That shit goes like this for me. I'm, I, I missed it. I don't get it. His hair is cute though. It's like some fucking, it's like gay pride every time I see him come out. It just misses me. I don't get it. Ass is flat, boy. That motherfucker got no ass. Always in his drawers. And I and some people when they naked just don't strike any type of sexual shit with you. Like you just be like, God damn, where are the clothes at? Can you put them back on? Cause your body is shaped like SpongeBob. Like I need you to put the clothes back on. And how the fuck you got a the same like you ain't got no dick bulge and no ass. Like that's just are you a Ken doll? Like the niggas built like a Ken doll, like an out of shape Ken doll. So anyhow, Ludacris made a joke about this motherfucker, saying some shit about, oh, he won't be around for long. Once again, Luda was on wildin' out with joking. This is a joking environment. I'm kidding. I left the show. I'm not thinking about Takashi 69. So here she come with her hair, bitch, in her feelings, trying to come for fucking Luda. Bitch! It was a fucking joke. Oh, which brings me to this raggedy bitch. I need to make a Nicki Minaj video. And I'm just going to, I'm going to touch on Nikki and I'm fucking out, bitch. I swear to God, this is the end of my video. And I'm just going to touch on it and I'm going, bitch. Remy Ma, and I'm not a fan of Remy Ma. But when that bitch says she literally has a dumb ass, accurate. Like, dead on. Like, bitch, you hit it on, you hit the fucking nail on the head. That bitch, she literally has a dumb ass. That shit is the dumbest looking ass I've ever seen. When she went on the fucking VMAs, the ass looked like, it don't look like, damn, bitch, I want to hit that shit. Her ass looked like, bitch, do you need to know what a bathroom is? You got a boo-boo? You got a number two, bitch? It looked like she got a shit on deck. You understand what I'm saying? It looked like she got a bitch. If I don't make it to this motherfucking bathroom, the fucking gas don't went into my ass cheeks, bitch. The gas bubble on went into my ass cheeks, bitch. It's spilling over, bitch. I'm crowning, and it started to leak over inside me, bitch. I gotta take a shit. I gotta take a shit. Like, that's what she looked like. And the barbs, and this is my other problem. See, the barbs, they need to do some vetting, too. See, the beehive, we gonna check Beyonce. If Beyonce get a little out of control, we gonna be like, Beyonce, come over here to the side, mind you. We not gonna say this in front of the company. We just gonna say this within the, within the quarters of the beehive. Um, B. Your ass looks stupid as fuck. Like, I need you to, whoever you need to go to, you need to get that shit fixed. But not the barbs, girl. The barbs is like, yes! You better work, Nikki. Fuck up my ass, girl. I don't know, bitch, but we love her, girl. Oh, girl, go ahead, bitch! Ooh, she looks like she got a shit, don't she? Mm-hmm. She needs some Gaviscon or something, bitch. We need to get her some Gaviscon or something, bitch. But anyhow, bitch. Oh, Nikki. So back to motherfuckers who can't take a joke. I was joking. So when we got two comedians to host the show, Tiffany Haddish and um, Kevin Hart. Comedians, what they do for a living is they make fucking jokes. They're joking. They're purposely making light of a fucking situation. They joke, that's what they do. So when... Uh, Tiffany Haddish make the joke about seven harmony or eight harmony or however fuck many of them bitches is harmonizing because they're all still strangers to me because I don't know these hoes but apparently they're big some goddamn weird so when um, 12 harmony she made the joke about 12 harmony Nikki got a huff feeling she come up on stage like uh uh don't say something about that whatever the fuck her name is because she that bitch first of all for you to be that bitch I gotta know that bitch I don't know that bitch so how she that bitch when I, she's an unfamiliar bitch? So she's not that bitch. So they're right there. Number two, bitch, I was joking. I was kidding. I'm not thinking about you, nor this motherfucker from 17 Harmony, bitch. I'm just here to get my goddamn check, tell my jokes, and go to fuck home. I'm joking. Just like your whole rap career. You know, bitch, you know about jokes and comedy, bitch. 
You just put out Queen. Hilarious, bitch. I'm pretty sure it's going to get a Grammy for Best Comedy, bitch. Best Comedic Album, bitch. Yes, the Grammy is coming for you, Nick. I wish that Tiffany Haddish would have read her ass, girl. I wish she'd have fucked her. Because Nicki ain't going to do shit. Nicki a punk bitch, girl. She recorded a whole... She recorded a whole motherfucking um, performance the week before the goddamn VMAs sat in the audience, bitch, and watched it with everybody else. Bitch still came to the show in it. She didn't record it because she couldn't make it. She recorded the shit, came to the show to sit amongst the rest of the motherfuckers to watch it. Girl, yes, bitch. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I'm just accustomed to Beyonce, girl. You know what I'm saying? And I, my, my heart bleeds for the barbs. My heart bleeds for y'all because Beyonce would just never do that shit to us. She would just never. First of all, Beyonce not going to give us a song, <clears throat> a single in January. And then say, oh, and by the way, I'm going to have that album for y'all about mid-August. Y'all cool with that? Yeah, the whole it's going to be mid-August, but enjoy these two songs, though. All right? I know I've been going for fucking 17 years. I'm back, motherfuckers, with two wonderful songs. Now, I'm going to go. i see you mid-August for the album, all right? Oh, fuck. I should make a video. All right, look. Well, here, take these two songs, and I'm going to make the video um, like three, three months from now. I'm going to give you the video. For the two songs. And then mid-August, I'm going to give you the album. All right? Not Beyonce ass. Beyonce come back like she dropping off luggage. Beyonce come back like, I'm back. Here's the album. Here's the album. And here's the videos. And, and here's a book. Um, also, I'm on tour. Peace. That's what I'm accustomed to. That's the shit I'm accustomed to. So when the barbs try to come for me, bitch, I you can't you can't argue with me because I don't I'm I'm not coming from a place of hate. I'm coming to place I'm coming from a place of not understanding. Help me understand. Don't come for me, bitch. Don't try to drag me. Just help me understand what it is that y'all looking at. Help me understand that shit. Cause see with Beyonce, I'm seeing an artist that's coming with a full product each and every time. That's original. With your with your bitch, bitch, I'm seeing a bitch that's coming that's looking for just like a little Kim bitch. I'm seeing a bitch that's looking very familiar to me. Like I've seen this bitch before. Cause I was I was seeing some of the barbs, girl. They wasn't here for the '90s, bitch. Oh, but my 37 year old ass was in the building. You understand me, bitch? I was here. So when little Kim came through, I was like, oh, look at this bitch. She is fucking unique. I never seen no bitch like this before. I never seen a female do rap like that. Okay. Some time passes. Nicki Minaj comes along. Now to the bars, they're like, oh, look at this bitch. I never seen a bitch do rap like this before. She's unique. To a motherfucker like me who seen little Kim the first time around. I was like, oh look, she's doing that little Kim shit. And that was that, bitch. That was that. That was my that was my Nicki Minaj. I was like, oh look, she's doing that little Kim shit. But hey, ho, girl, let me stop, girl. Let me go ahead about my business, bitch. Before Nicki fucking find my video and the bitch come for me. All I gotta do is if Nicki Minaj wanna fight me, I'm just gonna lead that bitch to the bathroom. I'll run some water or some shit. She's like, nah, uh, Brian Steve, you was talking about me. You wanna fight? I'm just gonna hit the Ooh, no, turn that shit off. You know, you're like, ooh, I swear when I come back to the bathroom, I'm gonna fuck you up. <laughs> okay, bitch, let me get the fuck off this shit. Um, how do I stop this? I don't even know how to stop this shit. This is how long I ain't been on this month. I'm gonna be pissed if I delete this video. Are you sure you want to end? Cancel or end? Well, bitch, I wanna post the motherfucker. <laughs>